Hey guys, and welcome back to episode 9, no, seriously, chapter 9. Back, back, we just jumped out of Wheatley's thing. Let's go. Where am I meant to go? I'm escaping. To what? Huh. No, I'm dead. Let's try again. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Maybe I was meant to put the port a portal up before I jump. As I said, well, when I started playing this, I never got this one. Yes, look, up there. I meant to use speed. You can't help but notice that you're not coming back, which is disappointing. Oh, I've got an idea. Yes, yes, in your face, I got armor. Fine, let the games begin. Yeah, they, they, they work, yeah. Um, they work quite well. Oh, those were the crap turrets, weren't they? Yeah. Well, no matter, because I'm still holding all the cards. And guess what? They're all full houses. Never actually played cards, meaning to learn. Anyway, new turrets, not defective. Ace of fours, the best hand. Unbeatable, I remember. Okay, there's nothing there. Do I go back and grab a dead turret? Oh, those were the crap turrets, weren't they? No. Yeah. Well, no matter, because I'm still holding all the cards. And guess what? They're all full houses. They're 
much to play cards, meaning to learn. Anyway, new turret, not defective. Ace of fours, the best hand, unbeatable. Oh, I would imagine. Oh. No. This isn't a game to be nice. Versus Moriarty, Aristotle versus Matthew's fight plates. Billy, Billy, Billy Wheatley. My vast intellect. Holmes versus Moriarty. Aristotle versus Mashu's fight plates. Stay still, please. Oh, oh. I'm moving. I will. I will. That was my fault. <laughs> Why did I think if you put a portal above you, you could my just. Fast Aristotle versus Matthew's fight plate. Oh, why was I looking behind? Why was I looking behind? The of my vast intellect. A vast intellect. Is Holmes versus Moriarty. Aristotle versus Matthew's fight plate. Stay still, please! Alright, stop moving! What? What was going there? What was going there? Ah. Uh. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Come back, come back! No. Did something break back there? Oh, oh, did it kill you? That would be amazing if it killed you. Hello? Oh, 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 yes, all right, no, just had a brainwave. I'll be back. If you're still alive, I'm going to be back. Don't die until I get back.
just been to hear in the incinerator. Year two, cryogenic refrigeration wing. Then, ten years in the chamber I built where all the robots scream at you. Then, I'll kill him. to talk to you for a moment, if I may. I'll be honest, the death traps have been a bit of a failure so far for both of us. I think you'll agree. And you are getting very close to my lair. Lair. It's weird in that first time I've said that. It sounds a bit, it's a bit ridiculous, really. But uh, I can assure you, it is one. It is a proper lair. Deadly lair. And uh, I just wanted to give you the chance to kill yourself now before you get to the lair. Uh, you can just jump into that masher, just there. Uh, less a death trap, more a death option for you. Sounds crazy, but, no, but hear me out, hear me out. Once you get to my lair, death will not be optional, all right? It will be mandatory. Okay, I'll take that as a no then. Oh my god, what has he done to this place? A lot. Um, Hitler, how do I get up into your sexy beam? Um, yeah, one's orange. Place is gone. You know, I'm not stupid. I realize you don't want to put me back in charge. You think I'll betray you, and on any other day you'd be right. The scientists were always hanging cores on me to regulate my behavior. I've heard voices all my life, but now I hear the voice of a conscience, and it's terrifying. Because for the first time, it's my voice. I'm being serious. I think there's something really wrong. Hey. We're gonna see Wheatley. Um. Oh, what? That's A. Yeah, that plan. Plug me in and I'll take you up. Look, even if you think we're still enemies, we're enemies with a common interest. Revenge. You like revenge, right? Everybody likes revenge. Well, let's go get some. Well, hello. hello. building is going to self-destruct in about six minutes. I'm pretty sure it's a problem with the light. I think the light's on the blink, but just in case it isn't, I am actually going to have to kill you, um, as discussed earlier. So let's call that three minutes and then a minute break, where we should leave allegedly two minutes to figure out how to shut down whatever is starting all the fires. So anyway, that's the itinerary. Also, I took the liberty of watching the tapes of you killing her, and I'm not going to make 
the same mistakes. Four part plan is this. One, no portal surfaces. Two, start the neurotoxin immediately. Three, bomb proof shields for me. Leading directly onto number four, bombs for throwing in you. You know what, this plan is so good, I'm gonna give you a sporting chance and turn off the neurotoxin. I'm joking, of course, good luck. Neurotoxin level at capacity in five minutes. Where are you going? Don't run, don't run. I'll tell you why you should run. The harder you breathe, the more neurotoxin you'll be having. It's bloody clever. Seven, seven. Oh, ah, oh, oh, ah! ah, that's sounding real. No, that was actually an impression of you. Because you just fell into my trap, my brilliant trap. Just said, I wanted you to trick me into resting that I didn't trick you, trick me, seemingly trick me. Ah! Explosion in four uh, minutes. What, what happened? What happened? What, 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 have you, what have you bombed to me? What is that? Hold on. Ah, the bloody bombs are stuck on. Doesn't matter. I've reconfigured the shield. Ah, it's a core you bombed me. Who told you to do that? Was it her? It's just making me stronger, love. It's a fool, man. Remember when I first told you I had to find that little portal thing? You were like, ah! What's the situation? Oh, hey, how you doing, lady? Name Drake. So you out having yourself a little adventure? What, are you fighting that guy? You got that under control? You know, because there's a lot of stuff on fire. Hey, countdown clock. Man, that is trouble. Oh. Situation's looking pretty ugly. Warning. Core corruption at 75%. Reactor explosion timer destroyed. Reactor explosion uncertainty emergency preemption protocol initiated. This facility will self-destruct in two minutes. Enough! I told you not to put these cores on, but you don't listen, do you? Quiet. Lord, quietly, not listening to the word I say, judgment. Simon, worst. All I wanted to do was make everything better for me. All you had to do was to solve a couple of hundred simple tests for a few years, and you couldn't even let me have that, could you? Gotta go to space. Yeah, gotta go to space. Nobody's going to space, mate! Have another thing. You never called me. Ah! Corruption at 100%. Ah! Manual 
core replacement required. Oh, I see. <laughs> Substitute core. Are you ready to start? Corrupted core. Are you ready to start? What do you think? Interpreting vague answer as yes. No, 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 no. Did pick up on my sarcasm? Stalemate detected. Fire detected in the stalemate resolution annex. Extinguishing. Oh, that just cleans right off, does it? Well, that would have been good to know a little earlier. Stalemate resolution associate. Please press the stalemate resolution button. Do not press that button. No! Do not do it! I forbid you to press it! Don't press that button! Don't press it! Come back. You're going to spice! Hard by! Moving around the stalemate button! What? Are you still alive? You are joking! You have got to be kidding me! Well, you! I'm still in control! And oh, I have go no idea how to fix this place! Oh, you had to play bloody cat and mouse, didn't you? What people were trying to piss off. Yeah, put your head back on. Well, we've gone in the full loop. We took Gladys out, and we've put her back in. Oh, thank God, you're all right. You know, being Carolyn taught me a valuable lesson. I thought you were my greatest enemy. And all along, you were my best friend. The surge of emotion that shot through me when I saved your life taught me an even more valuable lesson. Where Carolyn lives in my brain. Carolyn, delete. Goodbye, Carolyn. You know, deleting Carolyn just now taught me a valuable lesson. The best solution to a problem is usually the easiest one. And I'll be honest, killing you is hard. You know what my days used to be like? I just tested. Nobody murdered me, or put me in a potato, or fed me to birds. <laughs> I had a pretty good life. You and did. then you showed up. You dangerous, mute, lunatic. So you know what? You win. Just go. <laughs> it's been fun. Don't come back. Oh well. the machines he crappily built. Don't shoot me.
Now, it's going to be in the portal. It's nice going back to an old game. Ah, oh, that's a bit bright. Never been. That's a... Hmm. So the field looks alright. But the sky. Oh, the companion cube! And that, in the portal. Well, Enjoy the song. Remember when you tried to kill me twice? Oh, how we laughed and laughed, except I wasn't laughing. Under the circumstances, I've been shockingly nice. You want your freedom to be paid. That's what I'm counting. a lot like you maybe not quite as heavy now little carolyn is in you too one day they woke me up so i could live forever it's such a shame the same will never happen to you you got your short set that's what i'm counting Did you think I meant you? That would be funny if it weren't so sad. Well, you have been replaced. I don't need anyone now. When I delete you, maybe I'll stop feeling so bad. Go make some new disaster. That's what I'm counting on. You're someone else. I wish I could take it all back. I honestly do. I honestly do wish I could take it all back. And not just because I'm stranded in space. I'm in space. I know who you are, mate. Yeah, we're both in space. space. Anyway, you know, if I was ever to see her again, do you know what I'd say? I'm in space. I'd say, I'm sorry. Sincerely. I am sorry I was bossy and monstrous. And I am genuinely sorry. I'm in space. The end. <laughs>